good evening technology development is really helpful for the people in every sector maybe agriculture maybe industries maybe pharmaceuticals every way that is really coming in handy and now this particular technology is being used to settle the property disputes what are all this if you look at the whole country everywhere you see the property disputes especially with respect to residences and residential plots but how to overcome this again the technology is coming in handy the government the central government is using this technology it is using drones and it is trying to identify the various properties and assigning the same to the real owners i am meaning so if this is done successfully in future these disputes the number will come down gradually and what is the technology how is it being used i am going to show you now kindly have a look at this here it is so this is a 3d mapping of 6 lakh villages and 100 cities it began technology is the way of the future that we understood it is being used to lay the groundwork for new india because new technology is no longer restricted to a few areas or people but now being used to help the poor meaning earlier there was a feeling that the technology will be helpful only for the rich but now it is crossing all the boundaries now the boundaries are getting disappeared because the technology is really helpful even to the poor when it comes to the prime minister's ownership scheme which is based on modern technology is one such scheme that is now giving the owner its due by putting an end to the country's long standing property disputes what do you mean by this if you look at any court today there are so many disputes that are related to the property and these cases are long standing meaning so they are in the courts for a quite long period of time there were instances where the petitioners and the respondents have died but even then the judgments were not not, not you know this uh, given out not awarded then obviously so that will be really you know uh, very difficult for the people to go to the courts in this scenario now what should be done this technology is really helpful to the people the work of a 3d mapping survey in 6 lakh villages in india and 100 cities it is using drones it has begun under the ambitious swamitva scheme launched by the prime minister in october 2020 these points are important for the examination what is the scheme when it was launched this is an excellent example how the geospatial system the new drone policy and the liberal space sector can all be put to good use so by combining all these things this technology that is being used for good especially to the people who are poor and this is considered to be the largest aerial survey in the history with the drones mapping the residential properties of over 83 million indians using 3d mapping why in order to legalize them this is a wonderful method of using the technology for the benefit of the people and those properties are going to be legalized once the survey is done it will be easier for a large portion of the country's population to legalize and use their rural residential property as a financial asset as long as such assets are there in the court they cannot claim any anything from that right now since you know it's going to be legalized very soon 
by using this drone technology the 3d technology obviously these properties will be like you know financial assets to the poor very 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 important thing and uh, you have to follow these type of you know uh, the um, programs that are launched by the government especially when they are being used for the you know uh, for the benefit of the poor and all these things are really important and kindly remember technology has entered everywhere now everywhere and there is no bar no rich no poor right no developed nation no developing nation right so no uh, only urban areas only rural areas no boundaries are there everywhere the technology is very much being used for the you know benefit of the people and especially when this technology is used for the benefit of the people it's nothing like it and that is considered to be the real achievement of the technology for a great cause thank you so much and i'll see you in the next session